Hey there folks, my name is Dazrin, and welcome back to Amnesia, a machine for pigs. Okay, so I took a few days to look at my issues and problems that were happening with recording, and turns out, so I was thinking that it was Fraps, that that was causing the most uh, stress on my system. Turns out I was wrong. Uh, Fraps is probably the second most intense thing that's going on when I'm recording. And it wasn't my camera because I separate. I have a separate camera for that. It wasn't the game. It was my audio recording software, of all things. Adobe Audition was causing the most problems uh, with the game. Or with recording in general. It was, causing the, it was using the most memory and most uh, processor-intensive thing. So... For this episode, I'm going to be trying something new. I'm uh, using some of my old audio recording software, which is Audacity. Completely free program, uh, but should not be quite as intensive as Adobe Audition. So hopefully, hopefully, it will mean a better overall experience. All right, well, that's closed. All right, so those, I'm guessing, uh-oh. All right, so I'm guessing the flickering is not good. It means something is close by. Oh boy. <laughs> Stop with the kids laughing. Oh, that's never good. Blood and event. Oh, a teddy bear. That's always good. So yeah, hopefully, hopefully there won't be as many issues with uh, the. Okay. I'm putting it away every single time. Okay. Let me read this. More experiments with Compound X. Took the dog and injected it with Strike 9. After the expected convulsions and spasming, it died just after midnight. I immersed the body in a large tank of Compound X and introduced an alternating current via induction coil for a period of three and a half minutes. Partial return was induced. However, damage incurred prior to death was retained upon revival, meaning the dog continued in the acute state of, sti of strike, in sti strike 9 poisoning until I put a bullet in its skull. But drowning? Perhaps yes. It is, after all, known to be the kindest of suicides. If one were to drown, replacing the fluid in the lungs with compound X should theoretically be perfectly possible as a revival method. Interesting. Okay. So what do we got over here? Wait a minute, was this where I was at before? What the? Okay, that was pretty good. I liked that. That was pretty awesome, I have to admit. And now these are off. I have to admit, that was pretty cool. That was pretty awesome. I'll send that on its way. I guess I'll just move all three of them in there. Or not. Okay, fine. Just one. So, a lot of the... I've been reading a lot of the comments uh, on the videos, and apparently uh, a lot of people are uh, kind of disappointed with this game. Um, which is a little surprising. Uh, and I actually found out some things I did not know previously about the game. Uh, the Chinese Room uh, helped make this game, and they actually are the people who made... Uh, Dear Esther, which if you haven't played Dear Esther, I definitely recommend it. It's a nice, it's a very cool, uh, purely atmospheric purely atmospheric uh, title. I still need one more, don't I? I can press the button? What? I don't think, is that what I wanted to do? Just in case. <laughs> I don't know if the sound is gonna... I don't know. Okay, I don't think I hear... I don't hear anything. 
So that's good. All right. So now that I've done that, now what? All right, there's still one more though right here that needs to go in. I've got two, I need one more. So where do I go for the last one? I guess we go back up. Maybe, I don't know. Uh, let's see what's up here. There's the buzzing. That's still locked. Is there anything over here? No. But yeah, I guess the people who made uh, Dear Esther helped work on this, and I think that's really cool. Uh, I really, I liked Dear Esther personally, even though like you know it was nothing but a story that was driven by you walking around. I thought it was cool. Um, I'm definitely noticing that this one is much more linear, uh, in most parts at least. There's still some openness to it, like The Dark Descent. Um, but I guess they didn't really want to come back to this game. Uh, I was a little surprised to hear that. Uh, I was uh, my friend Clint from Terror Report. He's the one who told me that apparently, uh, yeah, they didn't want to come back to this game. So I was a little surprised to to hear that. Wait, wait, what? My journal. I have the compound. Oh, it hisses and steams in its container like some living thing, a witch's jelly to born, burn and corrode. The container is made from glass, a strange choice unless there is some particular reason why the metal that pervades everywhere else cannot be brought into contact with this so-called Compound X. I should investigate further for clues. Okay. So, where does this go? And, oh, am I gonna, oh, I'm gonna use this to deteriorate the lock, I'm guessing, right? Right here? Yep. Is there something coming? I don't know. <laughs> am, I, am I waiting for something to happen? I don't know what I'm waiting for here. What am I, what am I supposed to do? I don't know what to do. Um, can I take these teeth and, like, throw them at the, the lock? That'll do it. Or maybe I'll take the saw right here, and then just go... Okay. What the hell? Do I need to get more? Is there more down here? I don't know. Um... No, 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 what, what about my, 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 I don't know. I don't know. Is there something with this light? Oh. Oh. Uh, well, that's interesting. Whoa, jeez. Damn it. There's something coming. I don't know. Okay. Well, that did it work? It it worked. Ah, uh, blood. That's always good. Blood's always a good thing. Faster! Oh, we got a ladder. All right, down the ladder. Down we go. Bum 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 bum. Oh, you're kidding me, right? I'm gonna hurt myself jumping that far down. Here we go. Wee! <laughs> and I broke my knees. Oh, my hip. Hurt! Oh. In this leaking world, all these nails and no wood. What kind of carpenter are you? That figure cannot help but open its arms to you. Where is the strength in that? I'm dead. 
Bleh. Okay. You, none of you are going to recognize what I'm referencing. I just realized that. Absolutely nobody will know what I'm referencing there. Nobody. Oh, 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 my pancreas. Oh, okay. So yeah, this does seem like uh, it's a much more... Isn't it dangerous allowing this filthy discharge to collect so close to the core? We can use the flow to drive the turbines. There will always be a torrent of excretion <coughs> flowing through these tunnels. We can use this to supplement the steam production and ensure constancy. Dear God, the stench! This fecal matter is the true product of the age. Let's see here. My mysterious friend is correct. The sewers are indeed flooded. To descend further, I will have to find the local sluice pumps to, do, to drop the water levels. The smell is almost unbearable. It makes me gag. Why should the saboteur have flooded the tunnels, though? What did he hope to achieve? All right. Oh, you're kidding. You're kidding, right? What the hell? Are those electric sparks? So we got the water monster. It's back. That's great. Good news, everybody. Water monster's back. Everybody loved that thing, right? Everybody loved the water monster. Everybody loved the water monster. Water monster party. He's here. I hear you. All right, well, he's walking around. Uh. I'm gonna go this way. All right. Shut up! Shut up, water monster. I don't wanna hear your shit. Don't want to hear it, all right? You hear me? Okay. Several of the older forms have breached their containment area and escaped into the sewers. They remind me of my limitations. This is no Chelm, and I am no Eliahu. At least, not quite yet. It is the heat generated from keeping the doorway between open, that is, the doorway between open, that is to blame. We cannot simply park pack them about with coolant as we do at the center where the doorway is. I'm very tired. I'm sorry. The later versions are kept safe by the freezing temperature of those towers. Up here, where the air is hot and fetid, they become overheated and their duality tears them asunder as the other place flies from their cells as their vitae splinters. They live sporadically, torn from one world to the other and back again in violent, unpredictable bursts. For a few seconds, they are the creatures of this world. Then they are torn away to cease and cease to have physical form. This vicious ripping back and forth between worlds has driven them quite insane. I have ordered the affected areas sealed and will not allow my loyal workers to enter. These are damned places now. The abode of failed experiments, ghosts of fear and spite. Cool story, bro. Is there anything over here? Is there any reason to be here? Shut up, water monster. Shit. Don't call me. Seriously, this is going to become a one of those would you kindly moments. It really is. I know it is. Cause nope, not doing, not doing that. Okay. I hear you. Okay. 
Okay, he's over that way. All right. I'm trying not to disturb him. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Great. Oh, this is way down here. God, that's really, really annoying. Like, disturbingly annoying at the same time. All right. Well, there he was. So he knows where I'm at now, doesn't he? Maybe I should start running. Oh, it's you. Shut up. I don't want to. Oh, shit. Oh, this is where I was at. Okay. Shut up! I don't care about you, water monster. What's that? What's that noise? I have no idea what that noise is supposed to be, guys. Alright, anyway. Okay. Okay, this place is a freaking labyrinth. Great. I was talk- I was talking to Clint- hang on a second, let's listen to this. But we can save them. We can set them free. We can replace a rotten old world with a clean new one. Mr. Pettinus, you sound every bit the fanatic. Well, how can I be otherwise, Professor? How can any man of ethics simply stand by and watch this world drown in its own excrement? And your engineer. This visionary with whom you we embarked upon this course, does he share your views? Indeed he does. Indeed he does. The poor fellow has seen it all before. Now, oh. this is not the first great civilization he has wept for. And so you set about things immediately upon your return. Naturally, naturally. These things cannot be left to rot upon the tree. And sponsors were remarkably easy to find. I tell you, Professor, a trail of greed brings rich men to your door like pigs to truffles. Okay, I heard him. All right. Ah, crap. Looks like I'm going this way. Well, he was that way. Well, so let's go this way. Ooh, 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 what's that? And I said, look, my darlings, can you see it? And they said, yes, daddy, yes, we see it. A tall, weathered cap of a steep-sided pyramid, so like those of Egypt. Stone falling away from the summit, vines crawling about, intertwining the stucco serpents that thrive about the steps. A palpable sense of stillness, a weight of forgotten. And this, here, this is where the king sat. And this is where the priests lived. This house. This is the house of the dead. And here, where the sun strikes, this is where they threw the hearts that were not consumed. No, my darlings. They must certainly were not savages. That you see, they believed that the sky could fall on their heads, and they truly, truly believed that offering blood was the only way of stopping this from happening. Perhaps, my darling, perhaps they were mistaken altogether, or perhaps their tragedy was they could simply not spill blood enough to prevent the sky from falling in upon them. I'm waiting for me to finish reading one of those, and then all of a sudden... <laughs> squee! Oh, okay, so I gotta get that one done, and then some, uh, and then it looks like I gotta put a wheel on here, and then I can turn that. Okay. But it makes perfect sense. Alright, so. Guess we're follow- oh, never mind. Guess we're not following Piggy. Okay! So this is where we need to go when we're ready to drain everything, I guess. Okay, well, we are going to- Go ahead and end it here. So thank you all so much for watching. Like, favor, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. And I will catch you in the next video. Mer.